The Independent National Electric Mission, INEC, has cautioned political parties, candidates and their supporters to focus on issues and steer clear of attacks on each other during campaign activities. The INEC chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, stated this at a training of master trainers on election technology ahead of the 2023 general polls. Our correspondent, Margaret Obo, tells us more. Few weeks ago, political parties and their candidates signed a peace accord to be committed to a violence-free campaign process. Despite this commitment, actions by some political parties remain unpalatable and making a mockery of the peace accord. This has become a matter of serious concern to the electoral umpire, who has promised to continue to monitor the situation closely. Even as the commission is working hard to ensure a credible process in the forthcoming elections, Reports of clashes among parties and their supporters in some states of the country during the ongoing electioneering campaign is worrisome. Let me caution parties and their supporters to focus on issues and steer clear of attacks on each other. INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubu has allayed fears of many about the use of technology during the elections, giving fears about plans by some people to scuttle the use of the Biomoda Votal Accreditation System, Beavers. INEC can count on our readiness to continually partner with the Commission in achieving its mission of serving as an independent and effective election management body committed to conducting free, fair, and credible elections for sustainable democracy in Nigeria. The Permanent Voters Card, the Bimodal Voters Accreditation System, and the INEC Results Viewing Portal, which are the determinants of the true winners of an election. They ensure that every valid vote counts. Therefore, it is imperative for relevant election officials to not only know how to use this equipment, but also have a very good working knowledge of what to do when in with functions. As the 2023 general election approaches, a peaceful electioneering campaign is critical to the conduct of peaceful, fair and credible elections. From the nation's capital, Margaret Ogbo, Silverbird News 24. And meanwhile, the governor of River State, Nyeson Wiki, may have given away where he will be pitching his tent ahead of the 2023 presidential elections. The governor of River State is speaking after the Women Conference in Lagos on the 2023 elections, said Nigeria needs a leader that will confront the issues facing the nation as against one who will be pushing ethnic sentiment. Governor Wiki goes on to add that he has no intentions to contest for any positions in 2023, but will be looking to take time away from the political scene. For the governor of Lagos, uh, Baba Judy Sonwulu, a political party is contesting in the 2023 elections, should not pitch the supporters against other parties, but sell their ideas and ideology. We are looking for a president that has the interests of Nigeria. A president that has experience in governance. A president that Nigerian can say, yes, I remove food. I mean, can put food on the table. We'll fight insecurity. That's what we're looking for. Not some people who are talking about ethnicity. No. Who is on your mind? We Don't should, worry. We, we should be doing collaboration without, without, without hindering, without borderless. That doesn't, you know, um, put across party. You know, if you're doing well, you're doing well. It doesn't matter what you, and that's why we've called it. You know, we appreciate what he has done, what he has taken, you know, at the level of development has taken the state to, and we we'll continue to, you know, do peer review, peer comparison among the